Alright guys, so the Piggy Book 2 official trailer is out. It has been out, I'm sure you guys have probably seen it, and there is a lot of hidden things in this trailer. So I have spent the past few hours going through this trailer. I have probably seen it over a hundred times now, and I have written down over like a dozen things that are hidden and secret in this trailer that we're going to be talking about in this video. Now before we get started with this, I do want to remind you guys that if you are new to the channel, if you haven't yet subbed, do go ahead, hit that subscribe button. It's free. It takes three seconds because you guys know I'm going to be keeping you guys up to date with all the latest theories, news, and everything with Piggy 2. So go ahead and subscribe and let's go ahead. Let's waste no more moments. Let's hop into this. All right. So real quick, I'm kind of just going to skim through the trailer. We're just going to go beat by beat and then I'll show you guys all the secrets. So obviously it starts off here. We've got, uh, I'm assuming a flashback of Doggy here. It skips forward in some weird facility. I don't actually know what kind of facility this is. It's definitely some sort of prison or insane asylum because you can see it's all concrete and there's no wood or anything and there's like cells so it's some sort of like holding area for sure we've got zizzy here in some mysterious room we'll get more into her here in a bit and if we skip forward a little bit more we've got woofy I'm, I'm guessing this is woofy looking like some sort of spy again we're gonna get into all of this here in a second i just want to kind of skim through it make sure everyone's on the same page as, as everyone else we've got grandpa pig right here and then if we just keep on skimming forward we've got pony looking out at some sort of weird building in the snow and then finally we just keep on on going forward and then we have we have this right here this weird blue potion and then this weird mysterious shadow piggy figure that comes out of nowhere and i'm pretty sure it's penny so let's go ahead let's let's hop into all this all right so the first thing here is where exactly we are there's a few uh, i've already talked about it a few uh points here but i'm pretty sure this is some sort of insane asylum or some sort of asylum i don't think it's the same building as we see pony in if we if we skip here you can see ponies looking at a building it is definitely not the same building because this building you can see there's three points of entry light as you can see there's three doors three windows here and if we look here all of this is lit up so it can't be the same building at all and obviously all of this is concrete there's there's no wood or anything else here so this must be like some sort of prison or insane asylum or something similar looking at the doors and how they're not actually gel cells i'm going to imagine and guess that this is an insane asylum that's 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 my official guess it would make sense that that's why all the doors are kind of like uh, metal and not like just bars or anything. That's my guess on that insane asylum. If we let the trailer keep playing though, we've got Doggy right here. And this is interesting because I'm not really sure where Doggy is here. It kind of looks like he's near the gallery. If we look at the um, the end of chapter three now, like that ending cutscene, it kind of looks very similar to that. And then of course he's got the taser here actually from Jailbreak, which is interesting. And actually something very interesting is he's wearing a cop outfit. And if you look at his hands, the cop outfit actually has white hands. And then and he's got his brown dog hands because he's a dog. So this is just funny. Anyway, no idea what's going on here. It's definitely a flashback though, for sure. And yeah, I guess we'll have to wait and see. If we keep on going though, we do actually, I believe the next one is actually Zizzy. And this is interesting. Not a lot of people have caught on to this, but Zizzy in the scene, I believe has been kidnapped. I believe she's actually being held captive. I don't think it's in the same building simply because the walls are a completely different color. You can see these are brown and everything. Brown, yellow, brown and if we go here it's not it's gray and green so i don't think it's the same building but if you notice zizzy doesn't have her sword and obviously in the middle of like a piggy zombie apocalypse you're not going to voluntarily leave without your sword so she's definitely being held captive here she's also very angry you can see uh her eyebrows are very angry she's looking around confused and now she's ready to fight someone she's ready to like punch out fight someone so she's definitely being held captive here by who or what i don't know no idea what this brown stuff is on the floor either it kind of looks like um uh, well, you know, uh, that, yeah, yeah. But yeah, Zizzy gets kidnapped. There we go. Let's keep, let's keep going through here. Now, real quick, I want to pause on this. This door is the only door in the entire sequence here that has the handle actually somewhat open. Like something has opened it and tried to escape. And the glass is also broken as well. You can see the glass on here is also broken. None of the other ones have broken glass. So I'm not really sure what was being held in that room, but whatever it was seems to have escaped now. So that's interesting. But next up we have this. This, oh man, dude, this, 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 this. Okay, so first off, this is a female. Minitune has confirmed it in a live stream. This is a female. You can actually see the eyelashes as well. This right here is Windy Wolf. Now, here's the deal. I actually think that this is TSP. I think Windy Wolf is part of TSP. She's wearing an all black kind of like spy outfit here. She's kind of got like a spy weapon. The way she's holding it is very spy-like. I have no idea what she's aiming at, but whatever she's aiming at, I'm, I'm gonna guess maybe like a piggy or something. No, she 
she obviously takes them out. I also love that whenever she actually fires, she blinks her eyebrows uh, or her, her eyelids. You can actually see right there. She actually blinks. Very realistic stuff. So that's good. But yeah, I certainly think that this is some sort of like spy TSP movie, the spy piggies or something similar. Obviously, we're going to find out. Let's keep going. Now, this is where things get interesting. Not a lot of people have noticed this, guys. Check this out. Okay, so I'm going to let this trailer play out. And I want you guys to stay focused on the window of this door right here. You may already seen it. If not, I'll point it out. But I believe there is actually somebody in that in that window. All right, just just keep looking at the door here right there. I'm going to pause it real quick. All right, so take a look at this. There is an eye outline right here. All right. And then we've got another eye outline right here. And then we've got a giant frowny face right here. And the reason why I think it's someone in there and not like a reflection is because it stays in there at every single angle. As you can see, it just stays on the door at every single angle. Now, I'm thinking this might be Mr. P or Mrs. P. And the reason why I think that is because so far, they're the only characters that are larger than all the other characters. And if you look at the size of this character, he would be about the size of a regular door frame. And that's about the size that this one appears to be. So maybe this is Miss P. Maybe they're doing, doing experiments on her. Or maybe this is Mr. P being held captive. I don't know. If I had to guess, though, I'd probably say this is Mr. P. So that that's an interesting catch right there. Now, of course, we did kind of skim over this one, but Grandpa Pig is on his boat. That is Grandpa Pig confirmed. So Grandpa Pig is not Zom Piggy. Grandpa Pig has just been on a boat this whole time. So maybe he doesn't even know what's going on with the world and everything. And he's kind of just looking out over the ocean. So that's going to be interesting seeing this chapter. Maybe we're going to get like a boat chapter or something like that. Looks pretty cool. Now, this next part that's coming up, you're going to notice uh, a few things right here. First off, we've got doggies, uh, not doggy. We've got ponies glasses on the ground right here and these are definitely doggy's glasses on the ground because whenever it cuts it immediately cuts to pony so there's pony there's his glasses and there's his glasses on the ground so no idea what's happening to pony but pony does seem i think what's going on here is i think he's searching for zizzy i think if we go back to the beginning of the trailer where zizzy's being held captive right here i think that this is actually happening right inside of here and pony's coming to rescue i think that's what's going on no idea why his glasses are on the floor in this one in this little sequence right here no idea what's going on here but i'm pretty sure that this is pony rescuing zizzy from somewhere now from here a lot of people miss this if you let it play out a little bit bunny right you may have missed it right there let me actually pause and rewind a little bit bunny right come on right somewhere right here bunny shows up in the trailer it's literally for just like a split second like if you blink you're gonna actually miss it let me see if i can pause it right on it there we go right there now we've got we've got bunny uh, is, is bunny is bunny alive is 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 bunny alive so see here's the weird thing right like bunny's showing up here as like static like static on like a monitor or something and this is definitely bunny because she's got the the exact same eye patch over her eye and then this right here is her crossbow she's kind of just holding it in her hand so this is definitely bunny and this does kind of give credits to the idea that maybe she is actually alive somewhere maybe she's being held captive because at the end of the true ending remember the infected the infected they disappeared they weren't in the infected uh, ending of the true ending. They were in the good and bad ending, but in the true ending, they were all gone. So we actually don't know what happened to Bunny, but this is this is interesting. Of course, let me know all your theories down below as well. We got we got Bunny right here. And then if we let it just keep playing out. Oh man, dude, there's this. Oh man, there's so much stuff right here. So we've got a blue potion. Now I want to pause real quick. This is definitely not the cure. Okay. I don't know what this is, but it's definitely hundred percent not the cure. Okay. Mini tune is not going to just be like, oh look, there's the cure. Oh. Is that the cure? Oh, that solves that problem. GG, man. Let's go home. <laughs> End of that story. We got the cure. That was easy. No, it's that's not it. It's not going to be that simple. It's not going to be that easy. I don't know what that is, but it is definitely not a working cure. All right, you can you can bet money on that one. Now, obviously, the door here is blown off, and then I'm going to actually turn up the volume so you guys can actually hear this one. Uh, this one's important. We've got a black figure. Girl laugh. Piggy book two. There it is. Now, here's the deal. A lot of people have been speculating as to who this is. Obviously, Minitune doesn't want us to know. That's why they're kind of like cloaked in shadow right now. But I know who this is, guys. I know who it is. Check this out. This is Penny Piggy. And the reason why we know this is Penny Piggy is if we zoom in, now you gotta you gotta be very, very eye-catchy here, but there's actually a reflective light on their nose. This is a pig. All right, we're looking at a pig. We're also looking at a child. 
because you can tell from the height of the desk, this is definitely some sort of child. Now, the only two children we have in the game so far are Zizzy's sisters, George and Penny. This isn't a, uh, a zebra, so it has to be either George or Penny. And if we listen, that's a girl laugh. So this has to be a girl child, i.e. Penny, that's Penny right there, dude. I'm calling it right now. Another reason why I know it's Penny is if we take a look at the thumbnail for this and actually zoom in, you can actually see that it's Penny's model. So you can see down here that they're actually wearing a dress that goes down to their waist, which no other character in the game does so far besides Penny. So this is definitely 110% Penny Pig. 100% case closed. I'm calling it. I'm betting money on it right now. That right there is Penny Pig. No idea why she has red eyes or anything, but... That's her, dude. That's definitely her. Piggy Book 2. Now, Minitune has said that this is coming out in early September, so I'm really excited for that. Basically, like a week and a half more to go. But that is gonna be it. If I missed anything, let me know down below, and I'll make another video going over it. I've got tons of theories. So like I said, make sure you're subscribed to the channel. We're gonna be talking theories and all that stuff like crazy over the next few weeks. Like, man, there's so much in this trailer to talk about. Definitely don't wanna miss those videos. Make sure you're subbed. And of course, keep using Star Code Real Creep when you're buying your Robux, buying your Robux Premium. It helps me out a lot, and I really do appreciate it star code real creek in the roblox store thank you very much but yeah guys i'm gonna go get some sleep now we'll be live streaming some more later today talking about some piggy theories so be sure to join into that and i'll see you guys later today all right bye